Actually, a cover song, which you know, for me is kind of rare. Uh, I've been getting into covers. I, I mean, you know, I'm just sitting around the house thinking of all these cool songs that I love, and finally having some time to work some of them out. That's a Coldplay. Anybody wow. a Coldplay yeah, fan? Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of, I guess, maybe one of their more obscure songs, but. A 
do a song here that uh, you know I miss my Duster brothers. We miss uh, we miss playing for y'all for sure and and uh, we've been in good contact though I'll tell you that's for sure we've been planning and scheming and uh, it's kind of good you know I mean who can take who can afford to take some like a year off right <laughs> so no one but it, what you do if you if, if when you can't afford that is you put your no nose to the grindstone and figure some other stuff out and uh, we've been recording a lot of music actually and uh, you know um, we've recorded a bunch of songs already a couple of records and uh, I can't tell you any more than that right now but you'll know about them soon and uh, and we may even get together in person if uh, all this kind of works out at some point just spend some time in the studio to where we can spend some time on a on a real deep duster record but uh, I'll do a song that I love to do with the dusters and we don't do this all that often but uh, I just love the way that everybody sort of flows on this song and love to sing over the top of, of my beautiful band and I miss those guys so send this one out, out to all the Duster fans. This is called I'll Get Away. I don't need Hope you could not send. I can hear, I need no vision. I'll find a path with the wind. I'll get away. In the moment I was with you, made the bed, and there I laid. I took a long time to be decided, but decisions were never made. I'll get away again, I'll get away. a lot.
love this song here that uh, uh, my family has been carrying this song I guess around a long time in our lives and uh, it's just one of those melodies that stick out to you you know and kind of just stand the test of time stand the test of time some of the songs they go away you know they're there for a season and then you kind of get over them and you're ready to move on to something else but this song just kind of stuck around with us and uh you know i tell i'm sure some of you a bunch of you heard the story before but uh i think about this you know now because i live in the woods and uh as y'all do too everybody in colorado i guess but uh i kind of i need some uh firewood for heat and there's a lot of beetle kill around on my property and stuff that i'm trying to get cleaned up and uh so you know it's wood season gathering time because if you don't do it now you're not going to probably have enough so i've been kind of gathering some wood but it made me think of this you know when i was growing up we did that a lot and uh i would go with my dad out to this place near the frank church wilderness to cut some wood and i was just a little guy and uh i was just along for the ride really and uh he had this buddy named joseph smith who was a songwriter that lived out at the edge of the Frank Church Wilderness in a cabin that was totally off-grid, no electricity or nothing like that. And uh, so we'd go out there and cut wood all day and, and then he'd get, you know, my dad would fill up his truck as much as he could. And after that, we'd sit and sing songs and write, you know, around the campfire and that kind of thing. And, uh, and Joseph Smith would always sing this song. And uh, my dad got it from him and I, it was always around and then I got it from him, you know, and started doing it. I do it on fiddle or the guitar, but I'll do it on guitar tonight. But uh, anyways, I remember hearing actual wolves howling off in the distance during this song when I was little. And uh, if y'all never, never heard a wolf, it's one of the most powerful things I think that you can hear in, in nature. You know, when you hear that, it's both eerie and ominous, but it's also surprising how much power that a wolf has when he's howling, you know? And uh, way off in the distance, and uh, probably in the wilderness of, of that area somewhere. And, uh, you know, and, and just enough that it was just perfect for this song, you know? And uh, anyways, you can kind of imagine that, I guess, as you listen to this song. Covered with snow. There's a cold wind blowing wherever I go. Yeah, but I do not feel these things anymore. Mm, my broken heart left me as cold as the snow. flowing through the fields of my mind Yeah. 
is on fire Come back to me, darling, wherever you are Yeah, the taste of your sweet lips in October time Is the breeze that keeps a blowing through the fizz of my mind Is the breeze that keeps a blowing through the fizz of my mind Thank you. You guys, uh, you guys know John Stickley, don't you? Yeah. You heard him? Yeah. Stickley Trio. Oh, yeah. If you haven't, Google him up. <laughs> Get him up on your Spotify. <clears throat> well, John's a great guitar player, and... Uh, Spent a lot of time around Colorado, his own self, and uh, also a great dude. And uh, getting ready to have a baby anytime now, I think. Anyways, this. Uh, actually, let me go down one more step. As I mentioned earlier, the, uh, we I did a new record and uh, a bunch of this was done back in Asheville, North Carolina, and uh, while I was there at the record uh, label and the studio and all, John Stickley was there, and I was like, "Man, while you're here, let's do one together." And I showed him this song, and he, you know, he plays it better than I do in like the first time hearing it. But uh, it was a lot of fun because we just went in live. I played the fiddle, he played guitar, and I went and sang it, and we just did a live track, and he nailed it like, uh, like he'd been playing this song for, for some time. But uh, I decided to share all that stuff with you. But this one's called I'm Not the Enemy.
you there
Thanks a lot. I know that was far out, right? It was sweet as hell. We were waiting for the snake to come out of the box. <laughs> hey, I'm doing some different things on this record, this new record. That's that's one called Footprints, and uh, you know I've been listening to a lot of world music, especially lately. But that's kind of always been sort of in there in my brain, you know, as as, as things go along. And uh, I'm heavily influenced by that the Indian sound and stuff, and the, there's a lot of the Middle Eastern music actually. Turkish music is really beautiful in that way too. It's, it just kind of captures a vibe, but anyways, that's kind of, you know, with, with the advent of the internet and uh, all the things that we have our, as, at our disposal as far as musicians go, you know, it's like it's all thrown together in a pot now, you know, and uh, so that was something fun i just kind of been breaking out called Footprints. to try that on so <laughs> hey uh you know the string dusters won a grammy before all this went down too and uh, i'll do a song off that record and uh this is one i wrote with my buddy josh and it's called soul searching I carry on, do the best that I can, but still I struggle with who I am. So searching. was a girl and held me tight and I took all her love like a thief in the night. After all of this a time, I never dreamed that I'd be holding on to her memory. So searching. Thank you. 
to judge? Who am I to preach? If sometimes I wonder, would I be a Yeah, well, I've traveled this life looking for the signs and a pick me apart a piece at a time. So, searching.
with your daddy and your mama standing by. Thank you. 
and sometimes you just gotta fade out, right? Yeah. That was amazing. Oh, he does? <laughs> yeah, can you do the Giro? <laughs> <laughs> Just for Falco? <laughs> Falco says play a G-Run. Play a G-Run. Play a G-Run, man. Alright, I'm going to try something brand new, really out of my comfort zone, but I know you love me, so I'll, I think you forgive me if I mess up. <laughs> At least I hope so. Yes, we do. I really love you all, too. Thanks for, uh, for having me come out here and play for you all tonight. set the bar running toward the finish line that's why I'm still in the
That's a brand new song for me. So. Can't play that one in the truck. <laughs> it's hard to play any of this stuff in the truck. <laughs> Holes and some rosin. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do just one more song here in Call of the Night, but uh, I've had an absolute blast playing for you guys. And uh, I'm going to leave you with one here. This is one that I call a, a fight song, but in a good way. You know, uh, when you're going to school or whatever, you have the fight songs, you know, so you can win the games and stuff. And that's kind of like this song for me. Uh, you know, I watched Rocky growing up a lot. And uh, Eye of the Tiger, I think, is the ultimate fight song. But I thought as a songwriter, it'd be cool to try to attempt to write a fight song. And uh, so this is that for me.
appreciate it. Y'all stay safe out there. Thank you very much.
most epic. Dude, that yes. went a long way. It was thank so you. great. Yes. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I had a blast. Yeah. Heck yeah. That's I even broke a sweat. <laughs> hey, I even had butterflies for the first time in a long time. Really. I can't thank you all enough. I, I feel like I want to cry, so I'm not going to cry, but Go I'm going to say thank you very much. And uh, thanks to my beautiful crew, Drew Becker, who runs an amazing soundscape for us. And the lights. That's Jason Gutworth back on the lights, y'all. And uh, thanks once, once again to Kim and Justin. You know, uh, I've known you guys a long time. And uh, I played the last show with the Dusters in front of you guys. And I actually... You know, real quick before we go, I just was like, there's no, there's no way in hell I'm going on stage tonight. And somehow I was mustered along and went in there and we did it. But as soon as I walked out on stage, I saw Kim and Justin. And I just went, ah. Oh. Like, I just felt better. I don't know, like, it just made me feel good. And so I, I thank you guys and thanks for having me. And uh, y'all stay safe. Bless y'all. Be safe tonight. Try one.
my left And it ain't no sense in it to your friends in the boys of Baby, never mind, never mind, never mind
Thank y'all very much. Y'all have a good night. Thank you, Jeremy. Thank you, Drew. Thank you, Jason.